is my past, present, and future by Leslie Evans. My past, I moved to Pennsylvania in 2000 so my husband could meet his father. He hadn't seen him in 35 years. And my kids, they got to meet their grandfather. Oh, no, I'm sorry. I always worked way too hard. I never learned to relax. It was always get up every day, go to work, clean the house, take care of my kids. I completely lost myself. When we moved to Pennsylvania in 2000, my father did get to, my husband got to meet his father. He hadn't seen him in 35 years. They had good five good years together and then he passed away. Then we were stuck in Pennsylvania for another five years. Snow is not the thing. Now when you're dealing with so much snow in the winter, it's way too cold. I'm glad to be home. I love to read. F. Paul Wilson, Repairman, The Repairman Jack novels. I love those novels. They're my favorite. Hard to find. Very good read. I have three boys. Sean, Michael, and Nicholas. Sean, he's 23, he's in the Army. He's a helicopter mechanic. He works on the Koala. Eventually, he wants to change his MOS, and he wants to, um, he wants to work on the Blackhawks. He was deployed one time in Iraq, and he's supposed to be deployed sometime this, this fall to go to Afghanistan. The um, one thing about him being deployed since he is on the Kiowa, the Kiowas cannot deal with that kind of elevation, which means that he's gonna be, he's gonna be a foot soldier. That scares the daylights out of me, because at least when he was in Iraq, I knew he was stuck in a hangar, and he could deal with that. I didn't have to worry about him actually being out. Michael, he's 21. He's too much like me. All he does is work, but he loves to skateboard. He's always working, he's always <coughs> worried about everyone else. He never takes enough time to take care of himself unless it comes to skateboarding. He's, he's awesome. My son Nicholas, he's a daredevil. He, he loves to, if there's anything to climb, he's gonna climb it. If it's trees, rock walls, wherever, Waterfalls, he, I say he loves to scare me because he, he knows that it scares the daylights out of me, but he's a teenager, he's a teenage boy, he's a great kid. This is my baby, Boo. She's a Shih Tzu. Since my kids are grown and I never had a little girl, I got my little girl now. She's, she's the love of my life right now. She depends fully, wholeheartedly on me and she don't care what kind of car we have what kind of house we have. Just as long as mom is there to take care of her, she's happy. She's, she's a great little girl. I do plan on someday becoming self-sufficient where I'm not having to depend on anyone but myself. I'm tired of depending on, on my husband or anyone to make me happy. I need to learn to make myself happy instead of relying on other people to make me happy. I would love to travel to Bora Bora. That is my dream vacation. It's in a French Polynesia. It's called the Island of Pearls. And I, anywhere in the world to go, that would be my place, would be Bora Bora. I'd love it there. Or the pictures. <laughs> I love it. Um, again, I need to depend on myself to be happy. I can't depend on anyone else to make me there. Um, I am working on my own self-confidence, and I'm going to get there one of these days. Don't know how, but I will eventually get there. And again, I will be self-sufficient. Make sure that I can take care of myself and not worry about anyone else. That's my life.